I just heard, in, you know, while I'm coming up here, you know, they have a whistleblower, another whistleblower. <laughs> he turned out to be a fake. He's a fake. Highly partisan whistleblower. Uh, the lawyers contributed to Biden. They contributed to the whole thing. Is, but more importantly, you know what the whistleblower was? The same letter that we announced yesterday, which was perfect. It was, I couldn't have written it better if I wrote it myself. <laughs> I could not have said or had a better conversation. And we had a really nice gentleman in, the president of Ukraine yesterday. And uh, he was, he was good. And they said, was he pressuring you? You know, these animals in the press. They're animals, actually. Some of the worst human beings you'll ever meet. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Many of them are scum. And you have some good reporters, but not many. I'll be honest with you. But, uh, and that's one of the things we battle. And you'll find out. But they'll probably like you better than they like me. But I had to get us here, right? Right. But, but they're, they're total, uh, just terrible, dishonest people. And uh, they, went, they couldn't figure out, what did we say bad about this conversation? Then it turns out that they had senators, Democrat senators that went over there and strong-armed the guy. You better damn well do this or you're not gonna get any money from Congress. Oh, I see, that's okay. And then you have sleepy Joe Biden, who's dumb as a rock. <laughs> this guy was dumb on his best day. And he's not having his best day right now. He's dumb as a rock. So you have sleepy Joe, and he goes up, and his kid, who's got a lot of problems, got thrown out of the Navy for problems. I mean, look, I'm not gonna, it's a problem. That, that's a problem. So we won't get into why and all that. But he got thrown out of the Navy. And now this kid goes into Ukraine, walks away with millions of dollars, and he becomes a consultant for 50000 a month. And he doesn't know anything compared to anybody in this room, okay? He's a stiff. He knows nothing. He's walking away with 50000 or as you would say in the old days, 50 k a month. Right? Not bad. Would anybody else in this room like to represent the Ukraine for 50000 That's on top. <laughs> You got the check. That's on top of that's on top of hundreds of thousands and millions of dollars. But that's not the best one. The best one is China. This came up. So now he goes to China, and I was with the head of Blackstone, which is the big deal. Steve Schwarzman. I said, Steve, is that possible? No. Why? Why? Who got that? Who got that? I said, Biden said, Oh, well then, you know, he says, maybe I should get involved. You know, I've always very political, right? I say, uh, I say, Steve. Uh, what happens when you come off a vice presidential plane, Air, it's called Air Force Two, your father's with you, you walk into a room in China, and they give you a fund of 1.5 billion, billion dollars, you make hundreds of thousands of dollars and millions of dollars off that. And that's probably not all they gave, they gave me plenty more, I'm sure. We might never find out. And then they talk about me and I didn't do anything. I don't know if I'm the most innocent person in the world. 